Welcome back, gang. This is Torin, and this is part two of my Let's Play walkthrough of this brand new game from Sword Tales and Versus Evil. So last time we left off, we had opened up this well with the sundial over it, and our sword rose up like this, and as soon as this tree stops growing, we're gonna figure out what's next. One thing I've noticed about this game is that the checkpoints, when you pass through them, there's really no notification. So, when you end the game, you may end up having to redo a little bit of something because you didn't actually reach a checkpoint to save where you're at. So that's a little unique to the game. I'm not sure I'm a fan of it, but uh, this game is unusual in a lot of ways compared to other games. And uh, so I'm going to roll with it for now, and let's see what happens. This tree is freaking gorgeous, though. Uh, the tree is still growing. Can we climb up on this tree? All right. We can change how we're looking at it a little bit. What do we have going on over here? Oh, we went up on this ledge last time. We can't get up there now? Huh. Or was that, that's not the ledge we were on last time. Was it up here? No. All right, well, let's go up this sliding staircase and let's see what's up. Sliding staircase. It's not a sliding staircase. I guess you could slide down the banister, maybe. Is the tree on fire? What's going on there? Oh no, that's a little gargoyle looking dude. And the telescope is back. That's interesting. Can we jump across here? Whoa, don't fall down in there, kid! Can we, can we jump across here? All right, let's go ahead, let's look up in the sky. His sword awaits him atop the tower. Time is cruel, jeering at his ignorance. For he knows nothing about princesses. It's the guy on the horse again. The future hangs on the tip of a sword. Their spirits parted must seek the light. His heart must be his shield against evil. All right, we didn't break the telescope this time, so bonus for us. Let's continue around this, oh. Let's see what this says. Meditate and know your emotions. Come, we will enter your dreams. Um, let's enter the dreams again and let's see if they're different. Hey, I thought we entered my dreams. There we go. Let's see if the dreams are different this time. As much as it hurts, you must put your wishes aside. Who knows what harm they will bring? And Max Ryder said this might be Natharlatep? I don't know. That's a HP Lovecraft uh, Cthulhu-ish reference. All right, I'm putting my emotions where they belong. All right, well, we're in the desert again. And we've got to put the salt. All right. So this is all... This is all the same so far. All right. So we got that. The mage, convinced of his righteousness, was blinded by emotion and the ancient beliefs of the desert. That's the mage. All right. What about this guy here? By waking up, you will forfeit this dream. Um, We've been here before, I think. So I'm gonna say yes, let's wake up from this dream. Let's do a little bit, a little bit more exp exploration here. 
Is there more that that we can do? Is the tree not growing up anymore? Seriously? What is going on here? Whoa! I thought I saw... Oh, there we go. We pick up the scroll. This contract of knowledge is written on our skin in blood, in darkness, beneath the well. The tree of life will be revealed. Hidden deep in its shadows, the truth awaits your light. You must defy time, Moonchild. Sacrifice your childhood, and you can free us all. Whoa! All right. So the tree was back buried again. Whoa! What's going on here? Let's move this one more time. There's something down there that wants out. We'll jump on this puppy again. All right. Is the tree gonna grow up out of this thing again? It looks like it might. Fair enough. You're always surprised. It's the third time for me, second time for you guys. This, this little girl, she's like, wow, a tree. Give me that sword. I want that sword so bad. All right, tree's gorgeous, we get it. We really wanna see what we can unlock next though. I still feel like we're kind of retracing our steps on this one. And maybe we have to go back into that dream area, I don't know. Let's see, there were branches up on that ledge so maybe we can go up to that ledge and we can walk out on the, the branch. That That's my next guess here. So let's go on a little adventure around the edge here. Oh, now the tree is like way taller. Huh. Can we, yeah, that right there. Can we get on that? There we go. Yeah, very cool. All right. So we gotta go around this way. That takes us up to the next ledge. All right, we're doing it. All right, cool, cool. What What's up here? We're going higher up in the tower. Oh, look at that, a big old chain. Where's that chain lead? Across to the other side there, all right. Could barely make it out. The camera control to look around is a little interesting. Oh, oh, cutscene. Yeah, there's the sword, go get it, kid. Oh no, what the heck? All right, we gotta go outside, I think. Ooh, what's up here? More armor. Um, is this a grave? What is this? Get away! Whoa! Get away from me! You guys are nasty! All right, what's this guy? These are all like moon child statues. But they look like they can be pushed. But we're not pushing them right now. Get away from me, you guys are gross. Oh, there's another moon child statue. And what's down here? Wow, man. This game is kind of trippy. Uh, yeah, we don't want to go that way. 
We don't want to go that way. Whoa! Don't run off the edge. All right. Woo. Yeah, some of the camera angles are... Uh, Max Ryder mentioned that he wasn't a fan of some of them, and I am not either, to be honest with you, but we're going to continue anyway. We'll do our best. Stay away from us, you little weird... You guys look like toupees of doom. All right. What do we have here? We want to interact with this guy. Oh, okay, we hold X, roll it out. Oh, that knocks something down. All right. Oh, that, there's like a looks like a body hanging there or something. Um. Can we? Oh! What happened? Where are we? A cyclical universe is fated to repeat itself. All right, so we woke up. Where are we? Oh, so I guess we didn't die. We're back here. What the heck? Hey, there's the stag. Yeah, let's pet you. Now, how much of this do we have to go back and do? Do we have to go back over the tree? Up and around? I thought we would grab that vine, is kind of what I was thinking. All right, so we can make our way across the tree. Don't fall off the tree. We'll go around this way. All right, girl, you got this. And then we're going to go back up around the spiral staircase. Not the sliding st staircase, the spiral staircase. All right, let's do this. There's that freaky chain. We got this thing here. Ah, there you go, Scotty. If you'd push this other thing out, you'd be able to walk across. What about this guy? Yeah. Now, you won't fall to your death when you go outside, Scotty. Way to go. Sorry, little girl. Sorry, moonchild. And we're across. Whoa! Dragon! Holy moly! Uh-oh. Wow, this is pretty intense. All right, so it's just, it knows we're somewhere. I'm gonna take this slow. That looks like there might be a button there or something. Nope, can't interact with that little thing at the bottom of this pillar. Whoa! What's the statue? Come on. Yeah, we're going to go into dreamland. Our wants and needs are not always the same. What does that mean? I don't want to restart. Whoa, all right, beauty. That's the name of this dream, all right. Look at these freaky guys. They got like skulls they're floating on. You begin to grasp your memories. Follow the footsteps of great men by filling the sacred figures with salt. All right, we're gonna put some salt there. All right, got that. Wow, I'm not doing as as well on the salt here. All right, unknown powers forced you from the distant sky. You opened your eyes and saw the mage reveling in glory and madness. All 
All right. That's just the guy telling us the prophecy-looking stuff. All right, so we've got, oh, another pentagram or something down here. Thank you for moving, camera. Totally appreciate it. Wow, this has got some trippy stuff going on here. I'm thinking we just run through here. All right, got these little weird guys coming at us. Throw that one. There we go, we got through, awesome. Salt the pentagram, here we go. I don't know why I was moving a little slow there for a second. All right, so we got, we're got we putting this salt in here. This obviously is gonna activate another like mage stone or whatever that is. Hopefully this is uh, all right as far as the way we're filling it in here. Um, we must have missed some over here. I'm just pouring salt everywhere. Come on. What did we miss? Is anything gonna happen? Like, I guess I'm confused. Normally something happens once we fill these things up. All right. Maybe I messed that up, maybe I didn't, who knows. There's something on the ground down there. I'm confused. Where are we here? There's a giant face there. Huh. Maybe we missed something. We gotta be more precise about the pentagram, maybe? Let's try it a little bit more here. Let's see if we can figure out. Because nothing, usually there's like an automated response after we've filled these guys in in the past. Gonna uh, hit this corner over here, maybe. Okay, that's just putting salt down still. Let's get these guys. Let's go after them. Oh! Can we jump on that guy? There's, huh, I can see the end of the dream. I don't know if we want to jump here and out to that, but there's more pillars and platforms back behind there. Oh no! What the heck? All right, we're, we're in the dream again. We've completed this part. We were able to weave our way through here last time. Nothing really happened with the pentagram. Let's try a little bit more here. We'll salt it up. See, it turns blue as if we've connected all the lines. And when you hit X, it only... It 
Yeah, it looks like it's all taken care of. This almost looks like we should jump off this edge and maybe we could capture... Whoa. Maybe we could grab that, uh, that statue. Nope. All right. Let's see what else we got going on. What are our choices here? It's a little trippy here. It's a bunch of pillars around the outside of the beginning as well. Maybe when we get up here, we'll do a, another another view a couple times just to see if there's something we missed. Maybe there's a platform to the left or right. Did we miss anything? So far, it doesn't look like we did. And what about in these sections? see any platforms that we're able to jump down onto there's a platform it looks like it's right behind that head <laughs> Nah, that's not working well I'm kind of curious where we would leave off if I ended the episode here as well gang but I'm, I'm kind of feeling like maybe we should get some feedback going. And if I hear from you guys, maybe what you think, that might help us through this section. What happens when we hit those guys? All right. You know what, guys? This new dream has got me a little bit confused. Let me know what you think. Uh, maybe the pentagram thing is bugging out. Uh, maybe I'm not putting in the sand appropriately or the salt appropriately. And uh, let me know what you think, and I'll see you guys next time for part three of Let's Play Torin with Scotty Garbitas. Click like, subscribe, oh my, it's Scotty!